Bingo, got it. Alright, so this is like the first game of the night. Seaman doesn't really count. Uh, in case you just got here or... Uh, oh wait, I have to... I actually have to change this on Twitch because if anyone goes to watch a Seaman stream and comes to Kingdom Hearts, they're gonna be very disappointed. Hold on, let me, uh, let me switch that real quick. I really don't want to mislead people. <laughs> I really, really don't, especially with Seaman. Uh, yeah, let's start. But yeah, I think that a half hour of Seaman every day will be very entertaining, because we can just watch them grow, and we can take care of them, and it'll be like we're a big family. I should probably tweet out that we're starting Kingdom Hearts, too. Starting Kingdom Hearts. Twitch.tv. Got it. Alright, let's go. That was a little behind the scenes for you. Yeah, turn my monitor now. There we go. There we go. Did you know about Drake Bell in Kingdom Hearts 3? Nope. Didn't know that. Is that true? Alright. Uh, why did we save in Aladdin's town? It still says you're playing Seaman. You might have to refresh. It doesn't refresh for you. Uh, hmm. I gotta turn it down for myself. Ugh. This is exactly how we started the stream last time. I don't remember why we went to Agrabah, though. Didn't we, like, get sent here after something? He's a voice actor in Kingdom Hearts. Who is he voicing? Who the hell is Drake Bell voicing in Kingdom Hearts? He voices young Erakus. Erakus? What the hell does that mean? He voices himself. I would love a Drake and Josh level. Clanes, thank you for the sub. Oh yeah, I came back here after Monstro. Right, that's what happened. It's been a few days. Uh, but, you know, let's just resume then. I've kind of been excited to get back to it. He's a birth by sleep character. Okay. I mean, birth by sleep is on this collection too, right? Like, there's an HD version of it. Maybe I'll play that too. There's a lot of these fucking games. Did you hear about the Game & Watch minigames in Kingdom Hearts 3? I did not. What do you mean, Game & Watch minigames? No, I don't want to- I want to go back to the gummy ship! Why did I- uh, I could do that from the save point. I don't know why I didn't think to do that. Just go to the gummy ship, Sora. BBS has three stories. You might want to do it off-stream. You know what else has three stories? Sonic 06. There's a little trivia for you. I bet you didn't know that. Gummy ship. Yes. Okay. I think my magic is as good as Donald's now. <laughs> Why don't you go see Merlin? Work more on your magic. Why does it take their voice box? Like, it takes the text so long to appear. There's a tournament being held at the Coliseum. I hope there's a great reward for the runner. Again? I mean, alright, sure. Sure. There's four stories in Sonic 06, Mike. Nope, only three. Bet you didn't know. It's my little secret. I don't know what's going on here. What's up, Herc? What's up, Herc? Are you going to compete? It would be great to face- Yeah, I already said- We already talked about this. Didn't we do- th Like, is this already time for a new thing? You know the rules, right? Oh, Pegasus Cup. Pegasus was a good character in Hercules. Also, how's the volume? Oh, thank you for that, Shunk. The Colosseum will get new brackets at specific intervals. Alright. Well, now we jump super high, and I have to get adjusted to that. Ha! 
<laughs> oh yeah, there he you they introduced Pegasus when he was a baby. That was like Hercules's baby present when he was born. Disney typically has strong horse characters. Thunder. Thunder. I guess so. I can't really think of a weak horse character. It's very easy. All I remember about Pegasus is the scene where he can't get into Phil's house. I kind of remember that. I remember him not liking Meg. You, uh, can we, can we fucking kill this dude? I kind of want to save magic after this for, uh, summons. Yo, okay, someone just mentioned Bambi. I just remembered, you just reminded me, I had a fucked up dream about Bambi last night. I don't remember much about it, except I think some, like, it was real fucked up. I remember this one specific visual from the dream that was really, really disturbing. It was like... Something about Bambi's hunter... Like... Basically, Bambi got, like, fucking killed and eaten by a predator or something, and then Bambi's hunter, like, found that predator and killed it, and then took Bambi out of the predator's dead stomach and ate it? I don't remember! <laughs> that was really fucked up! What the hell? What did I eat before I went to bed? It was really gross! What the fuck? Summon Bambi. No, I'm trying to remember what the context was! I don't remember. But he was like... It was really fucked. Oh man. I'm going to be thinking about that for the rest of the stream now. Ugh. Also, I woke up with my wrist, like, bent, like, 90 degrees the, the wrong way. I don't know if that's related. You just had your first Seaman dream. Oh, no, you're right. Did any of you have Seaman dreams last night after seeing Seaman? That's the power of the Keyblade! That's the power of the Keyblade! Yeah, did you guys get a... Do you have any Seaman dreams? It's because of Seaman, Mike. Well, I wasn't the only one who witnessed it. Oh, wait, you have to do something special to these guys, right? How do I kill these dudes? Uh, maybe I have to use, like... I don't know. I mean, I think I'm damaging them. Yeah, I'm damaging them. Okay. Well, they give you a shitload of experience points. Those are called wet dreams. I knew someone would say that. Listen, if you know we're all thinking it, you don't have to say it. Oh, boy. Pots and barrels. Just like that store. Thunder! I had a dream that I was eating a burger, but then I looked down at the burger and someone that I had never seen before was... Wait, hold on. I had a dream about eating a burger, but then I looked down and the burger was someone that I had never seen before and my hands were covered in guts. Okay, yeah, that's gross. Welcome to the Kingdom Hearts stream. Oh boy. Welcome to the Kingdom Hearts stream. What gross dreams have you had recently? Yeah, give me your grossest dreams. I had some. Dr I had a dream that I drank some ant water. What's that? What's ant water? Water with ants? Sure. I had a dream about Diddy Kong last night. That's not a gross dream. That's a. That's a blessing. You had a good dream last night, my friend. I still think one of those sound effects for Donald is a Mickey sound effect that they left over. Or a- or Goofy, whatever. Whoever makes that <laughs> noise. Thanks, pal! Goofy! Goofy! 
I have no idea how they make the Donald voice. I've really tried to replicate it, but I don't know what they do. Leon and- what? What? Why do I have to fight you guys? Oh no, I need summon power. I gotta- I gotta build up my magic gauge. Oh no. Let's take out Leon first. What?! Do I have to start the whole thing over? Oh! Oh no! I thought Donald would heal me! Oh... Uh, yeah, sure. We'll do it again. She got me. Can't skip that. I can't rely on Donald for fucking anything. I'm gonna save my magic. I'm gonna try one more time. It didn't take that long. I just rely too much on Donald. People have told me not to. I guess my faith hasn't waned yet. I shouldn't trust him. Never trust a duck! Not bad at all! I can use a little magic. I just don't want to waste too much of it. If there's a flock of weak enemies, I'll use thunder, but that's it. Yep. Yep. Good job, Goof. Goof Troop. You guys ever seen Goof Troop? Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Ah, oh, fuck. Come on. Come on, you big boy. Come on, big boy. Goofy, why don't you... They just don't jump attack. I have played every game in this series besides the first one. I thought it looked painful to play. It's not. I like it. I'm having a good time. I mean, the level design is the worst part. The combat's simple, but it's still fun. Uh, the story's fun to laugh at. I think if you go into it with a non-serious lens, uh, it's, it's entertaining as fuck. I think 2 is probably my favorite of the ones I've played, but I think 1 is still fine. It's just, it's just, there's some really, really bad shit in it that you kind of have to deal with. I think that it's one of those games that's good in spite of itself. Despite itself, or whatever the fuck. Whatever happened to Pete's son, PJ? Pete had a son named Pete. Wait, you know what? I kind of remember him. What does PJ stand? Okay, so here's the thing. I'm not going to do that again. What the fuck was that? What? Great. Okay. Well, I guess we're just not going to do that then. I guess we just won't play that then. Probably just Pete Jr. <sighs> Pete Jr. did this. I've never... This hasn't crashed before. Nope, no more. Not, not doing that again. Disney. Yo, you, Disney's in this? Alrighty. What if it just deleted my save file? What if we just had to play Seaman for another two hours? Ugh. <sighs> <laughs> PJ is a cursed name. No one can speak of PJ ever again. What was the name of the evil deity in, in Seaman? Pabda? Did it also start with a P? We might be in trouble, guys. Let's just fucking forget it. Gummy ship. Pabra. Okay, so Pabra is... is Clearly, the new enemy of this stream. Pabra. Alright, well, I'm not doing that. 
Where do I go now? Uh... I'll just go here. Why not? Disney is the Nintendo of movies. I've often compared Disney and Nintendo. I think that that's a very, very good comparison. Let's just go this way. I mean, even if I'm not supposed to go here yet, going here right now will let me warp back to it, so... Oh boy. Oh boy! I'll just have to go back and do the Hercules Arena later. What the hell was that? Am I supposed to go in here? Maybe. Doesn't Monstro block you if you try to go to the bottom half path? Does he? I don't know. There was like... I was trying to see which one had more stars, which was more difficult, but there were too many stars and I didn't feel like counting them. Mike, I can't believe you haven't customized the gummy ship at all. You loved nuts and bolts. This is nowhere near as fun. This is super boring. It's just like, what is that going to accomplish? You know, you're only in these stages for a couple minutes at a time. With nuts and bolts, it was the whole game. This is just like a little side area. This is boring as fuck. Are you going to fight the bonus bosses? I don't even know who they are or where they are. Sure, I'll try them eventually. If you can't miss them. Gummy Ship was legit my favorite part of Kingdom Hearts. That blows my mind. Where are we going? Ugh. It's very fun. Yeah, Kingdom Hearts 2 had a better Gummy Ship from what I remember. From what people reminded me. But, I don't know. I just find this incredibly boring. I mean, I kill everything really fast anyway, so what's really even the point? You know, do you, like, upgrade it, like, to have more guns? What's the point? What's the point? It's boring because you ain't customizing it. I guess you could argue that, yes. You could argue that. But I feel like in order for me to be interested in customizing it, I have to be, like, engaged in, in the gameplay at least a little tiny bit. And I'm not. You know, like if I was interested in the in the mechanics themselves, maybe I'd be more interested in customizing it. But I'm not. All right, what is this level? What is that? I don't even know what that is. What is that level? What the hell is? Wait, what am I doing? What? I went through all of that? Oh! I clicked on this! I clicked on this! You took the warp. Oh! Oh! Oh, good. Good. Good! That's perfect. Let's just warp here. I guess I wasn't supposed to take the warp. That's great. Okay, so now we're back at Aladdin's land again. Ugh. All right, so this time we just don't take the warp, I guess. Yo, this, this whole Kingdom Hearts stream today has been nothing but resetting things. I've been streaming it for 19 minutes, and we have ap approximately accomplished zero minutes of progress. Yup. These things are like little green owls. What are you doing? Cursed by the sea man. I feel like bringing the sea men into this stream was a bad idea. It was a bad move. Let's just go past it now. Alright. I guess if you look at it, it was blue. It's just like the Ultra Wormhole ride in Ultra Sun and Moon. I'm having a blast. I'm 
I don't even know where I'm going. I'm gonna guess it's Nightmare Before Christmas, but I don't remember. Whenever I hear the Nightmare Before Christmas music, all I can fucking think about is that Mario 64 Halloween mod I played years ago. Remember that? Huh. Was that the one that ended with, like, the space thing? Like, where it was like you had to fly to the different things? Or was that... I played two Halloween mods, I think. Where are we getting that? Nope, not yet. Not yet. What a lot of people don't know is that Kingdom Hearts actually also takes place in the dream of a sleeping god. And Goofy is the only one who has achieved Chim. Chimini, Chim, Chimini, Chim, Chim, Cheru. Yep. Uh, yep. Yep. Is it true that they're, that they're making a, another, like a sequel to Mary Poppins? That's a sequel, not like a remake? I was never big into Mary Poppins. And I am 100%, I know that it's pronounced Kim, but I like Chim a lot more. Oh, whoa, a boss fight. Wow. Two bo- wow, there's so many bosses. I vaguely remember hearing that. I don't remember if it's true, though. Yo, a star! Okay, I went the wrong way because I got confused. Two Chewbacca's! There's one. Let's grab that. Yep. I knew it. I knew it. Pumpkin Hill. Oh boy. I forget if they, like, get dressed up in this game. Oh fuck. This, like, MIDI version of this song. Holy shit. I forgot all about this. I don't remember if I liked this level or not. Oh yeah, look. Look at that. <laughs> they just standing there. This sure is a spooky place. I bet they're, the people here are scary looking too. Don't worry. We look spooky too. If they scare us, we'll scare them right back. You think so? Oh man, look at Gooby. Goofy, I need to like look- can you- I wanted to look at you from like an angle where I can- Why are you always looking at me dead ass right in the face? I wanted to see your eyes! Donald is a little mummy man. This isn't even like the real song. This is like a- Sounds like a knockoff version of it. If they haven't transformed for every other level, why start now? I always wondered that. It felt weird. I like the idea of them transforming. Yeah, welcome to the Bloodborne stream. Wait. No, kill them? Yo, what if this game crashes again? Have you seen the Funko Pops of these specific outfits? No, I haven't. What the fuck are you doing? Goofy looks horrifying. Goofy always looks scary. And now, allow me to introduce the master of terror, the king of nightmares, Jack Skellington! Hey, it's the guy who's on all those tattoos! Bravo! Those ghosts will be a big hit at this year's Halloween! Thank you, thank you. But their movement still needs work. It's not scary enough. I huh? want to strike bone-chilling terror. I'm going to consult the doctor. 
then I'll go attend to the decorations. Why do so many people have tattoos of of Jack Skellington? Can we also can I just say I might not be the biggest fan of this movie, which I know people don't like because they're like Michael, that's the best movie ever made. I don't hate this movie. Um, I'm just not a big fan of it. I will say, I like the name Jack Skellington so fucking much. I really, really like the word Skellington. What the hell is all this stuff? Now this is the song. This is, I, remember, I know this song. I wonder why they use like an actual song for this from this movie as the background music, but then in the other levels it didn't feel like they did. Like they didn't really have any Phil Collins blasting in Tarzan, but that's probably like a legal rights thing. Hmm. But yeah, I do appreciate the fact that they dressed up. The only level where I feel like it well, in Kingdom Hearts 3 the whole visual appearance changing for stuff like Toy Story and Monsters, Inc. actually makes sense. Because it wouldn't make sense for, like, there to be a human walking around the fucking Monsters, Inc. world. But yeah, I kind of wish that they had changed appearance for every level. That would be neat. I like Halloween aesthetics, too. Yeah, I agree. Hmm. I don't understand. Maybe the guidance system was damaged in the explosion. Nonsense. My devices this are This is the ugliest perfect. character I've ever fucking seen. Oh, I've got it. Why, of course. The heartless need a heart. Of Doctor, course. Do you think we can add a heart to that device? Certainly. A heart's not all that. Is he a duck? Uh, I think he's a duck. Work. To make a heart. First, take a container with a lock. It's fucking gross. We need the key to this thing first! Yo, what if someone played this game without having seen a single Disney movie in their whole life? This would just feel like the most dis- Like, it would feel like so fucking random. Like, who the- What the fuck is this level about? I almost feel like you need to know these characters to, like, I don't know. I don't know. You're really gonna unlock it for them? Why not? If they succeed, we won't have to fight the Heartless, right? Besides, I want to see the Heartless dance, too. Sure, okay. Don't you? Not really. Yeah, they did a pretty good job adapting this Hi, movie to amazing. a level. Uh, and you are... Sora. Well done, Sora. I'd like you to be a part of this year's Halloween. What's this Heartless doing here? Oh, the Heartless came to town just recently. What's frustrating is I can't get them to dance with me. So, the doctor and I are trying to improve the guidance system. Uh-huh. He's quite a genius. Okay, doctor, let's continue. The ingredients for a heart. Pulse. Emotion. Terror. Ugh. Fear. Hope and despair. Mix them all together, and we have a heart. Sure. I mean, it looks like you have a heart already right there. Missing some ingredients. I bet we'll have Let's to go collect them. Memory. Sally. Sally. Is Sally Good like the Frankenstein's nothing. monster Don't girl? Why I bothered creating her? Sally's got the memory we need. See if you can track her down. See that? No That's problem. what the inside of Sora, Goofy's mouth should like look like. Come along? Sure. Remember when I said Goofy's mouth doesn't look right? All right, whose turn is it now? Uh, we swapped out. I think it's Donald and, and Jack we want now. Yeah, let's go with this. Okay, Jack. 
She's so fucking gangly. Look at this dude. Why wouldn't Sora... Sora's like immediately just okay with this dude. This is a massive fucking skeleton and he's just like, Alright, cool, let's talk to this dude. Yeah, alright. Is there a save point I can get? Because I'm afraid of it crashing again. Sally should have the memory we need, but she's not here. Where could that girl be? There's a 5'11 and 6 foot joke in here somewhere. Jack! Jack! We have a major crisis! That's Dexter's dad, isn't it? The Heartless are completely out of control! We can't stop them! Hmm, maybe our experiment triggered something. Everything will be fine, Mayor. You have nothing to worry about. So Dexter's mom and Dexter's dad are in this fucking game. I don't... I don't like that he has two faces. The Heartless are completely out of control! The festival will be ruined! Feed me! Feed me! Oh boy, now we have to fight the Heartless. Oh, I remember liking the battle music in this world, though. Yeah, let's go. Hmm. I kind of want to switch, I don't know, I wanted to have a projectile magic spell on my quick select as well, but arrow's really good. I like thunder. Ugh, and cure is like necessary. What the hell was that spell, Jack? Is Mandark in this game too? Mandark was a dickhead. Mandark sucked. What's the best Halloween world in all of video games? I've, didn't we have this conversation somewhat recently? I feel like we did. I don't know, that's tough. I think we might have been talking about just spooky levels in general. Or maybe we were talking about spooky music? If we were talking about spooky music, I still think Mario 3D World has one of the best ghost themes in games. Also, I want to save. Pumpkin Hill is alright. Pumpkin Hill is alright. It's good. It's just also like... I'm not like a huge fan of the knuckle levels. The knuckle levels. It was during the... Oh yeah, you know what? We were probably talking about it during Simpsons Hit and Run because of the fucking Halloween level in that game. Where else is there to go? Oh, fuck. Look at the texture on them. Do they always have that, or is that just in this level? Yeah, I mean, if we're talking about just Halloween levels, there aren't too many specifically Halloween-themed levels, are there? Also, this is a Christmas-themed level, really, when you think about it. Let's see. Hmm. Well, there's no way for me to get in there, I guess. I guess that's just unique to this level. I mean, honestly, like, I really like this aesthetic, though. It's nice. It's also very different from everything else in the game so far. I kind of appreciate that they put this movie in the game. You know? It's very, very different from everything else. I mean, the graveyard isn't like... Alright. Let's check this place out, too. Once the Heartless here are out of our way... You have to pull on that thing three times for some reason. Is it ever... Do you get a hint for that? I don't know. Like, my favorite thing in games is variety. When they kind of try to... 
add a ton of different elements, and I like that they they didn't just go with like all classic animated films and stuff. This is this is very different. So cool, very nice. The Jack Skellington. I mean, I fucking still call every skeleton I see a skeleton. It's been ages since I've seen this film, but I don't remember. Is Was Jack Skellington ever a human? Or is that just like he just has always been a Skellington? Oh, fuck. Zero, have you seen Sally anywhere? <gasps> is something wrong, Jack? That's Jasmine's no, voice. They just used her again. Right. We're going to have the best Halloween ever. All we need now is your memory. Memory? You mean this? What? No, that's a flower. It's a flower. What are you talking? I need a Jack, memory. I have a bad feeling about this. Why don't you try something else? There's still time. Nothing could beat what I've got planned. Once we get the Heartless a heart, they'll dance just as I envision it. Trust me, you're going to love it. Did they never like made a sequel to this, did they? I'm kind of surprised. Because this movie is continues to be like incredibly popular to this day. I still see shit about like I still see Jack Skellington on shit constantly. Can I talk to Zero? Can I? Zero. Goofy, you know this dude? Give it four more years. I don't know. Maybe I should watch this movie again. I don't know. Oh, fucking Phil and Lil's voice actor! Did you hear that? Yeah, I sure did. A heart. What should we do? Gosh, you really are stupid. Isn't it obvious? Tell Oogie Boogie. <laughs> <laughs> you little shits. Fucking annoying little kids. It's just Lil. It's just Lil's voice actor. Um... I think if you watch the film again, you'd appreciate the claymation. Yeah, I mean, I love claymation. It's like my favorite form of animation, and I feel like I'd, I feel like I'd appreciate it more. Maybe I was too young when I saw it. Um, I don't know. It's one of those things that I feel like I need to watch again. All right, listen, we got her forget-me-not. Yes, this is it. Now, just one more ingredient. We need surprise to complete the heart. The mayor should know where it is. All right. <laughs> ah, that bonehead Jack is really making a heart. That's gross. I'll be Isn't he full of that like worms? Ooh, when I get my hands on that... Well, I've got no hands, but I'm still gonna <laughs> that to the heartlet. Stupid as fuck. <laughs> wasn't there a... Wasn't there another movie that was kind of... I don't think it was... I don't know if it was Tim Burton, but, like, where there were, like, sack people that had, like, hearts inside... What is this movie I'm thinking of? Wasn't it, like, a... a wasn't it, like, a number... Am I thinking of- what am I thinking of? It's it's just- I, that dude reminded me of it. Nine. Nine. Everyone's saying it's nine. Can I Google nine real quick? I'm just gonna Google the number nine. Nine movie. Yeah, 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 that's what I'm thinking of. I think I saw this. Yo, this is just Sackboy from Little Big Planet, but with glasses. Was this movie good? I definitely saw that. I might have even seen it on in theaters. I I kind of what the fuck was that movie even about? Oh, 
I don't remember what it was about at all. It's on Netflix. Huh. It's really old, I think, by this point. Yeah, I have no memory of it. Number cannibalism. Did seven eat nine in that movie? Oh, I gotta turn the game down a little bit. I was, uh, I don't know, after seeing Rampage the other night, if you weren't here yesterday, I talked a little bit about it. Uh, I kind of got interested in seeing what, what other games in the Rampage series had come out. Like, and it's really been a dead series for a long time. Apparently there was a planned Connect reboot of the game, but that never happened. Uh, they've, there's some really fucking weird monsters in the most recent Rampage game. There's, like, really weird monsters in that game. So, like, the first Rampage has three playable monsters. In the latest one, there's, like, fucking 40. And some of them are real fucking weird. And the art direction in the, in the latest game is also, like... It's just super fucking bizarre. It's kind of ugly. It was on the Wii. I was looking at it, and I was like, what the fuck is this shit? Is that the level up we got during the, the I almost said casino, the Coliseum before the game crashed? I, re I remember the 64 Rampage game being my favorite. That's the one I rented a lot from Blockbuster as a kid. There's an arcade game based on the movie. There's a game based on the movie based on the game. It was alright. I mean, if you were I talked about it more in depth yesterday. It was really dumb. It was just a dumb, dumb, dumb monster movie, but that's kind of all I was expecting it to be, and I kind of enjoyed it because of that. It was really over the top, really dumb, a lot of fucking stupid one-liners, lots of explosions. There was actually a Dave and Busters in the movie, so that makes sense. Yeah, the movie is very, very not similar to the games at all. It's similar in, like, its name. The name of the movie and the names of the monsters are the same. That's about it. Who is Dave? What, you know who Buster is? I've never been to Dave and Buster's. No, I've never been to Uvu Java. Hey, bust up! Alright. I have to find the mayor. He was, like, in town. I don't know why I'm in here. I kind of wanted more experience points. Alright, good job, Jack. Did y'all hear about Harry Potter? What about Harry Potter? Just, like, it in general? Yo, I found- guys, I found this series the other day, Harry Potter. You guys heard of this shit? It's fucking mental. Harry Potter died. What are you talking about? Why is Scum Labs not in Rampage? Yeah, I kind of wished it was. You're in the right area, I'm pretty sure. Back there? I thought I had to find the mayor. I thought the mayor was, like, over... Wasn't he, like, in this alleyway in front of the laboratory? I thought he was here. Huh. I saw a preview for that new Fantastical Beasts movie with Dumbledore. And, uh, it kind of... In the trailer, they used the Harry Potter music. The one that goes... Toot, 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 toot. And I felt like, that's not fair. That's Harry Potter's theme. This isn't a Harry... Harry Potter's not even in this. You can't use that. You can't use that in that movie. It's not real. It's not right. 
Yeah, it didn't look that great to me. I'm not a big Potter head, but it's like, I don't know. I feel like even if I was, that wouldn't really do much for me. Okay. Can we just... I just want to open this chest. Dundara G. Let me pull this again. Someone said I had to pull this three times. That's the third time I've pulled it. I don't know if it has to be consecutive. Maybe. Two. Three. That's three. Oh, you just get an elect- okay. Alright, well then maybe I do have to be in the graveyard. Alright. Did you know there was an alien Hogwarts student? What? Wait, hold on, what's this? Did he just jump in? What the fuck? Cool, alright. What do you mean there was an alien at Hogwarts? There's the the mayor. Ghosts rise from those tombstones. Check the tombstones in the order the ghosts appear. Oh, good. If you get it wrong, you're in for a surprise. I'm joking, Mike. Okay. Well, I don't... Hold on. Can you start over? Was this one... Nope. Ghosts rise from the tombstones. Check the or- Got it. Splendid! Now look at the pumpkin! No! <laughs> it just blew up. <laughs> okay. What the fuck is going on? Jack in the box. That's a surprise. Well, that was some surprise, eh? Oh. Really? A pumpkin? No. That was Donald. Is that really a pumpkin? No. He's eating it! Okay, well now we go back to the lab. Back to the lab. In this town of Halloween. Is this place called Halloween Town? Because Disney already had a thing called Halloween Town. That I'm pretty sure predates this film. Yes! Yes! That's it! There you go. This time it's sure to work. They have the Halloween Town movie with Marnie. What? <laughs> you little shits! It's the same Halloween Town. Holy shit. The nerve of those little hooligans stealing my work! Oh boy. Yo, that's a good plan. Hey dudes, how should we steal this heart? How about while the old guy's rolling it over, we just dive and put one of our necks under the wheels. That's a good idea. What the fuck did that- what was that noise? After them, quick. Yeah, we got a dog too. His name is Goofy. And mine's alive. So, he's probably faster than Zero. There better be a ha Halloween town in Kingdom Hearts 3. Uh, that's a good question. Would you guys like any returning worlds? We might have talked about this already. I don't even remember. Part of me doesn't want any. Even though I do like continuity and I'd like to see people be like, Hey, Sora, it's been a long time since I've seen you. But I don't know. I kind of would prefer it if it was all new worlds. Though, if they did do any worlds again, I would really, really like them to try Lilo and Stitch again. I'd like them to, to completely redo Lilo and Stitch and, like, actually make it take place in Hawaii instead of on the ship. 
I'm hoping that they don't spoil too much before the game comes out. Doesn't Kingdom Hearts reuse levels all the time? Yeah, it does, but it's also been a really long time, and I feel like it, there's been a lot of new movies since then, and a lot of movies that still haven't had levels. I don't know, I think it would be nice to just have an entirely fresh batch of levels. There's gonna be a frozen town, and you know it. I feel like there has to be. I'd like a Tangled level. Tangled was fun. I mean, I wouldn't, like, prefer it over other stuff, but Tangled was, was decent. I, I was gonna do a Frozen Olaf impression, but I don't know what he sounds like, but could you imagine, like, him joining your party and being like, Sora, here, take this healing potion! Is that what he sounds like? He probably sounds like, Hi, Sora, it's me, Olaf! It's me, Olaf, from Frozen! Sora, I need you to collect all 17 of my frozen eggs! Zootopia level. If they did a Zootopia level, they would have to turn Sora into an aminal. It's actually a combination of those two voices, Mike. Well, I can't do that. Tangled in a, uh, a Tangled and Big Hero 6 world are already confirmed. Really? Let's save again. I'd love a Wally level, but I also don't know how much they'd be able to do with it. You know, Wally's one of my favorite Pixar movies. I also don't want them to overload it with Pixar. Okay, uh. Where would these kids have even gone? Maybe back to the graveyard? There's only like three areas they could have gone to. Just go back to the graveyard, I guess. Nobody talks about Treasure Planet. I've never seen Treasure Planet. Was Treasure Planet the one that had that little pink thing? The, like, little dude that kind of looked like a goldfish that could float around? I feel like my brother had a stuffed animal of that growing up. That's a thing and a half, huh? Okay. I feel like nobody, like, really talks about Treasure Planet. Was it a good movie? I see people seem to be saying it's good. Maybe they didn't market it well or something? Monsters University World. That would be really... I feel like that wouldn't be a good idea, because they already got a Monsters, Inc. world. Um, okay. Let's just go in here, then. This game has a shitload of just go to place, return from place, go back to place, go further in place this time, but then go back, you know? Um, unless this isn't where I'm supposed to be, but I think it is because there was that little cutscene. Yeah, there we go. That was a very good... That's a good transition right there. Lots of fighting, too. But yeah, I mean, I wouldn't be opposed to some returning levels. What would be neat is if maybe they did returning levels, but, like, made them take place after. Like, if they had it... Okay. Lion King level, but it takes place during Lion King 2, Simba's Pride. I remember liking that movie as a kid. But looking at it, it's so fucking funny how much worse the animation is. It's ridiculous. Hundred Acre Wood again. Well, that seems to be like... Hundred Acre Wood and, and Coliseum or Olympus seem to be like recurring things. What about, uh, what else? I've, like, thought about most of these ideas. What's another Disney movie that, like, has a legit shot? Not, like, a meme one, like, Lizzie McGuire World. What's, what's one that you think has a genuine chance? 
Uh oh. Thanks, Donald. Thanks, Donald. Moana. Yeah, Moana, I still want to see that. Wreck It Ralph, I still think would be weird. I love Wreck It Ralph, but I feel like it would be very, very bizarre, and I don't know how they'd explain some stuff. Emperor's New Groove would be fantastic. I would fucking die. I would love it. But yeah, Wreck-It Ralph would be weird because I feel like that... Okay, I know that like it, they they would make it work either way, but it's like... You're in... You're in... Uh, would, would they do like a whole like, Hey, Sora, you are a video game. <laughs> like, I don't know what how would they would handle that. I could see a Marvel world by the time Kingdom Hearts 5 comes out. Bitch, you know none of us playing Kingdom Hearts 5. Maybe our great-grandkids will play Kingdom Hearts 5. On their Facebook mega console. I haven't seen- people were talking about these Game & Watch minigames that were confirmed for Kingdom Hearts 3. I really haven't followed, like, anything about Kingdom Hearts 3. I watched the Toy Story trailer, and I watched the Monsters, Inc. stuff, but that's it. That's all I've seen of the game. Yeah, you know, that's actually interesting. I've never thought about that. How come Robin Hood never got a level? Like, the classic Robin Hood? Also, Jungle Book? Has Jungle Book gotten a level? Has Jungle Book got a level in this series yet? That almost feels weird too. Can we just... Can you guys go get him? I don't feel like going down there. Nice. Vidya, thank you very much for that. Bugs Life. Fucking, I would love Bugs Life. I would love Bugs Life. Bolt was Disney too, right? We were talking about that the other day. I remember liking Bolt. I feel like Bolt really isn't, like, a contender for a level, though. No one seems to talk about or remember that movie. Okay, an inside-out world, but they go inside of Goofy's brain. Okay, that would be really fucking great if they had Goofy, like, get incapacitated or something and the whole level took place inside Goofy's head and there were, like, the emotions, but they were goofy versions of them. I would fucking love that. That would be awesome. <laughs> Just a bunch of goofies. In there. <laughs> goofies inside out. Like, you know how when they zoomed in on, like, the... on, like, the dad's brain and whatever, it was all, like, the dad versions of the characters? There would be goofy versions of all the emotions. Do these enemies stop? They were just gonna leave. Goofy just goes into a coma. Goofy's in a coma for the whole game. All the trailers they put out, just to trick us. Inside Out was good. I liked it. I knew Oogie Boogie was behind this. I haven't seen Meet the Robinsons. I never had any interest in it. That was I talked about this last stream. That was during that very weird era of Disney movies that I don't really understand what they were going for. It feels like they were trying to find their footing with 3D. I'm gonna fall off the level. Yeah, what about a home on the range level? Yeah, I'm sure it was like a decent movie. I'm just like not, I don't know. I don't really feel like it was like it doesn't remind me of Disney, you know? I think it took them a little while to, to figure out how to make something that looked like a Disney movie in 3D, if that makes any sense. Like, they've actually really managed to nail the look of, like, a Disney princess in 3D. They, they like, Rapunzel looks like, you know, she looks right, if that makes any sense, given the aesthetic of their other princesses. I don't know if that makes any sense. What's this? 
didn't they? Oh yeah, there was a Fantasia level in 2, wasn't there? I forgot all about that. 2 had some other, like, interesting ideas. Brave. Brave could be neat. Brave was Pixar too, yeah. Pixar- Brave was like the- the first movie- I liked it, but Brave was the first Pixar movie where I was like, this doesn't- doesn't feel right, you know? There was something about that movie that didn't feel very Pixar to me, and I don't know exactly what it was. I think Brave kind of felt a little generic. I remember the music being fucking awesome in that movie, but it kind of just felt like a, you know, princess doesn't want to be what she's supposed to be, she wants to be something else story that, like, it feels like has been done a zillion times. No knob, no keyhole. I mean, it looks like a curtain. You could probably just go through it. I mean, maybe I have to see it again, but that was, like, the first Pixar movie where I started to kind of lose interest in what they were doing a little bit. Because I used to... I, I fucking had seen, like, every Pixar movie up until Brave, and then I kind of just stopped following them. Up. Brave was just like not as good as it could have been. Yeah, I think that might. Are you guys just gonna walk off the edge? I was just gonna just hit you with this. Yeah, Noctis will probably be in. Well, you know what? Noctis can wear a Gordon Freeman costume in the Windows version of Final Fantasy, so maybe we'll get a Gordon Freeman level. Kingdom Hearts 3 is Half Life 3. Coco level. Coco is a little recent, don't you think? I mean, I don't know. They could make it work. Well, the thing is about have like opening the floodgates to Pixar characters is it doesn't necessarily even mean there has to be a level for all of them. They could be summons and they could be stuff like that. Like Bambi doesn't have a level, but Bambi's a summon. We could at least get like some Pixar characters as summons or something. That would be cool. Uh, can I make it back there? Uh, yep. Okay, what about in here? Oh no, I gotta. I have to fight. Man, this is- there's a fuckload of Heartless in this level. I feel like, yeah, Lightning McQueen summon would be kind of fucking stupid and I'd love it. <laughs> Sora! ka dude! Dumbo world. I was thinking about that too, but I don't know what they do for Dumbo. Has there... Hmm. Was there ever a Snow White level? Was that... Was that in Dream... No, not... Was that in the PSP one? Alright, what do we, how do we do this? Maybe, uh... Oh, try lighting it. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, well, I, I didn't have time to get on it. <laughs> yeah, I guess that was in the PSP one. What about, like, has there ever been, like, a, a Cinderella level? I'm thinking back to, like, these more classic movies, and now I'm not sure if there, if there's ever been these levels. Ah! No! Are you kidding me? That's not even a death, you just have to climb back up? That was also in BBS. Interesting. Sounds like they kind of covered all of their, their old bases that they missed in that game. This is great. I need to stop fighting everything. I just don't want to like get under leveled, but I don't know. What other new levels were there in, in BBS? Because I never finished that game. How the fuck do I get back up there? There's no, like, door on this. Wait, hold on. What's this? Look at that. Yeah, there was... I know about the Lilo and Stitch level. 
monster house level. That was not true. Also, thank you for that, Doc Master. How about a Walt Disney's Education for Death? The make. What? No, they wouldn't put that in the game! Um. Now we gotta light this again and then wait for it to come back down. Treasure Planet, I mean, I don't know enough about. Monster House was. I remember seeing Monster House, and I kind of remember liking it. Alright, let's just not fight these dudes. Hall of Presidents level. <laughs> I would like a Country Bears level. I think it would be really fucking dumb. Just thinking of rides that they could make levels out of. What's in here? Am I gonna just fall down if I go in there? Come on, fellas, let's go! Brother Bear. Holy shit, I forgot that was a movie. Ice Age level. What is this? Huh. Uh, I think I saw Brother Bear in theaters. Thunder. Get down from there. I could definitely see Princess and the Frog. I feel like we've talked about this like a zillion times, though. But yeah, I think that's pretty likely. It's been so fucking long since the last mainline kingdom. Well, I mean, they're all mainline. It feels it's been a really long time since two, I guess. How long is like in in the series? How long is it? How long of a time gap is there between Kingdom Hearts two and three? Like, is there like two years? How long is the is the time skip? 60 years. 10 years. Uh-oh. We have to fight the kids? They're kids! Two years. I think it's dead, it's just, like, not targetable anymore. Oh! Oh! Yeah, you, you're gonna get it now! Bambi, go! This just heals me, I just wanted to use Bambi, I haven't seen it yet. Look at you, Bambi. Oh. Oh, look at all that. Wow. Holy shit. What the fuck? Is this allowed? That's cool. Look at Bambi's face at the top of the screen. <laughs> he put his hands up. Sora, stop. We're just following orders! Oogie Boogie told us to steal the heart! It's all Beryl's fault! He, it was his idea to tell Oogie Boogie about the heart! Yeah, that's right. But, but you guys said... You should be ashamed of yourselves! Those are the ugliest goddamn characters I've ever seen. Look at how ugly they are. Look at how ugly he is! Fox and the- oh, Fox and the Hound was a fucking sad movie. Like, the part where they drive away... I should check my abilities. I have two more points. Hurricane Blast. Sure. I like aerial combos. Uh... Do we have any more- no, we don't have any more shared abilities. Uh, Treasure Magnet. They're wearing masks. Yeah, but they're extra ugly without the masks on. I would wear a mask too if I looked like these guys did. Alright, I think we're good. I think we can just leave now. Ah! 
Bye bye. They're dead, Mike. Are they? You can go down the oogie door. All right. Oh, you mean? Oh, okay. I see what you mean. I thought you meant in here. Because you said no, and no usually means Michael. You gotta go back. You mean the like green one that was locked before? Was Sora dead the whole time? Jack's legs are fucking giant. Look at these steps he takes. This isn't even the, the only Jack Sora teams up with. He teams up with Jack Sparrington as well. Alright, let's see. Now we can go through here. Yes! Oogie Boogie! Give me back that heart! That's my Jack Skellington impression. You want it? You well, want it? Come on over and get it! It's yours, my friend. As long as you have enough rubies. <laughs> now, let's see if I can get their attention. Oh, hello! One, one came, two came. This is it? Yep. Nobody disrespects me! Uh oh. No! What is this? A root? I don't remember this. What the? I don't remember this boss fight at all. Why do games do this all the time? What is it with fucking casino bosses? There always has to be like a slot machine and a fucking casino machine. Can I just hit him with. Oh! Uh oh. Uh oh. Genie! Come on, Genie! This was actually in the movie. I don't remember that. Get him, Genie. Get him! Kill him! Oh. Heal me! Donald! Oh, good. Hit. That didn't do anything, Genie! See that that cyclone move I got? All right, which one do I have to do? How do you? Okay, he's over. So you want to hit the one that he's? Okay, I see. I mean, I can get just. No, wait, I can't get him from over here unless I just do this. Whoa! All right, I got gotcha. you. That's not too tough. Why am I still locked in though? What is this? I've done like no damage to him this whole fight. Nice fire attack, Jack. Jack, were you able to throw fireballs out of your hands in your film as well? Can we just... What the fuck is this? This is a kind of fucking weird boss fight. I can't tell if I like it or not. Okay, hit this one. Go, go, go. We made it. Come on, Simbus! We got the power of Christmas on our side! These are very long summon animations. Isn't Epic Mickey actually a really good game? I haven't played it. I remember the, the concept art for that game being really fucking weird. I'm gonna fucking die. Great. Good amounts of damage there, Simba. Come on, baby! <sighs> yeah, he's kicking my ass. 
Whoa, alright. Can't really see it because I'm locked onto him. Ugh. Alright, let's go. Come no 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 no. Where are you going? Gotcha. Gotcha, bitch. Let's kill him. Let's kill him. Yeah, no! Wrong way. Fucking god, this boss is annoying. Bambi and Tinkerbell are the only summons worth a damn. What does Tinkerbell do? Ugh. Buzzsaw. Ow. Yep. Yep. Tinkerbell flies. Alright. Oh, he's on the fucking wrong side. God damn it. That doesn't even hit him. Damn it. Damn it all! This is a really... I don't know if I like this boss fight. Ow. Those things shoot me with guns? Yep, come on, baby. Come on, baby. You can knock the dice back at him. That's a thing I didn't know. Oh, great. They're both dead. Good. They're both dead. That's great. Awesome. Can we, uh, just wait for him to... Alright, get, get him. No, no, I don't want to... I'm locked onto him, so... Okay, alright, okay. Yeah, yeah! Ugh. Ugh. All right, let's let's throw the dice back. Yeah, they stole this from Yonoid too. Yo, okay, cool. Use a phoenix down. I don't even know if you're joking. I don't remember if those are even in the game. You can do. Wait, how did you get back alive? <sighs> Any day now. Kill it, Jack. Kill it, Jack Skellington! They just get back... Oh, I hit a button by accident. I guess they just get back up when they feel like it. That doesn't hit. Hey, I don't know if that hit either. Yeah, this is definitely my least favorite boss so far. Ow. Ow. Please don't. Please don't call me that. Just, what am I supposed to do right now? <laughs> Come on! <gasps> Look at Donald just casually fucking strolling along. Oh, they, they bounce now. Yep. Can you... Alright, let's, uh... Hit it, hit it! Good. Trapped. You're trapped now, Oogie Boogus! Nope. Yes! No, I fell off the ledge! I don't like that he... Like, even if I'm jumping, he knocks me back. Come on, baby! Oh. I really don't want to die. Staying locked onto him during the... What? It kind of fucks me up. Yep. Uh-huh. What are you doing? What are you doing, Oogie? This dude probably smells fucking disgusting. Just full of fucking worms and grubs. What the hell is this now? What is he doing? I can't hit him from down here. I hit the wrong switch again. Okay. Yeah. He healed. Great! This is really fucking tedious. Alright. Okay. 
Throw some dice that I can actually hit. Oh, you can hit the exploding ones in the air, I guess. I really, really do not want to die. Stop. Uh. 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 Alright, let's stop him right here. Okay, good. You can do some damage. Let's go. Come on, Flag Toilers, let's move! Nope. Nope, only got a little bit of hits in, then he knocks you off. I hate that you can just barely reach him. Like, you just barely can't reach him up there. Ugh. Jack, just stop trying, Jack. Nope. You might be underleveled. I don't- I feel- I've been fighting fucking everything I've come across. I don't think I am. Then again, I haven't done the Colosseum yet. Which isn't my fault. Got him! Uh! Well, that's disgusting. What if Timon and Pumbaa just showed up and were like, Oh, free lunch! So that was, that heart was a failure after all. Oh. Obtained the holy circlet. Yeah, we could wear his skin. It's kind of fucked up, but you're right. So was Oogie Boogie the bugs? I was, I was having a good ass day, too! Whoa, how did he get so big? Look, it's brimming with the power of darkness! Oogie Boogie is drawing power from those dark globs! You know that because... So we just have to destroy those things, right? Alright, fellas. Let's get to work! Not that way. Nope. Nope. Let's go turn around. Alright, fellas. Let's get to work. Alright. Uh, let's just climb him. Yeah, keep hitting it. Don't get any experience points from these. I better get experience points when I finish this fight. Uh-huh. What? Nope. Got it. Oh, there's another one down there. Good dame. Uh-huh. How many of them are there? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck! Ah! Ah! Ooh. Please stop this. Nope. Alright, where else? There's one. There was also one that I don't think I destroyed. So, for tech, those just count as experience points, right? I keep seeing tech P. 
and I don't I've never asked what that was I'm assuming that I'm just getting experience for doing these things all right let's just try thunder thunder works Oh, it spawns them. All right. Where's Jack? We came to his world to save his shit, and he's not even here. All right, that's one more down. Oh, fuck. Fighting these dudes is going to get me killed. Soa. That's what it sounds like he's saying. There's one down there. Ugh. Oh, there you are, Jack. Practicing your jujitsu. You know, we're trying to we're trying to make a change here, and you really What The fuck? The fuck? That's all of them. That has to be all of them. Oh, there's one on his head. I think. I thought I saw. Maybe it was the purple spots. I'm just, like the purple glowy clouds I'm seeing. This does not look good. It's me, Jack Skellington, from your favorite film. Where the fuck is another? Oh, there's one. Whoa! Whoa! No! 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 Come on, come on, baby! Yes! I did it! This sounds like Star Fox music. You know what? It kind of does. How did he even do this? You beat him and then he just got huge? What? The keyhole was on the ground all along. It was the earth. It was inside of us for the whole time. Now let's go back and do the Coliseum. And then I'll switch games, I think. Gravity has been upgraded to Grav... Gravira. I know, I'm going to Olympus. Sally, I gotta train a little bit. Why didn't I listen to you? Don't feel bad, Jack. We'll come up with another plan for Halloween. No, wait, that's that's Phil and Lil's voice actress, too. Next time, we'll do it together. Yep, that is for sure. For sure. I guess we have no choice. We'll have to cancel the Heartless Halloween Festival for now. Oh. Here, I want you to have this. Pumpkin head. Visit us anytime, Sora. Well, what about us? Uh, well, if you come with Sora, I guess, next year's Halloween will be the scariest ever. Emotion, memory. We put it all, put in all the necessary ingredients. What else do you need to make a heart? What is a heart, anyway? I can't figure it out. All right, well, we're leaving. Jack, we're leaving. We're leaving, Jack. Us. You don't have to come. Jack, I guess you're just walking us to our ship. Yeah, the game was still out. I turned it back down. Check the new keyblade. All right. Um... It's not that huge of an upgrade, but I kind of wish that these had like more distinctions so they weren't, they just all feel like, like direct upgrades. You know, they do have like unique characteristics, but they kind of just all feel like they're just better than the next one. Yeah, this is a good Keyblade. It has like something 
going on with it aside from stats. It's got better reach, I guess. Eventually, Keyblades start being more different. Alright, so where do I go? Back to the, uh... Guillotine Gate, I think. Halloween Town's quiet with Oogie Boogie gone, so we're gonna shake it up. Quiet is born! I'm not doing anything bad. Not now, anyway. <laughs> Alright, let's go back to Olympus. Alright. Got that level done with. Olympus! Trophy earned. Pum Pumpkin Prince. If you weren't here earlier, uh, we did this Colosseum challenge once and failed on the boss. We lost to Leon and Yuffie. And then we did it a second time and the game actually crashed. Which was weird. We should also check out our new abilities. I feel like someone must have... Yeah. Donald, uh, Goofy... Tornado. Uh... Raises luck so that enemies drop rare items when... I'll use Tornado. Uh, Sora. Sora! Strike back after parrying an enemy blow. Increase tech points obtained by parrying enemy attacks. I feel like if I get tech boost, I'll level up faster. Hmm. Strike enemies ahead of you with a powerful... F I kind of want that. Have you been using your attack defense ups? Do I have those? No, I haven't. Those are things? What are they? Defense up. Oh, shit. No, I haven't. I only have this one. Okay. Yeah, I'm just going to use them all on Sora. I don't see any reason to use them on anyone else. Alright, let's save here, and we'll go try this again. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, the Pegasus Cup! Can't skip. Can't skip it. Alright, I hope this doesn't crash again. That would be very unfortunate. But once I catch up to where I need to be in the Coliseum, I'll probably switch games. I haven't been streaming this for two hours yet, but I also uh, did a little bit of Seaman before this. So I've kind of like, I feel like maybe my next two games aren't going to be full two hours each. Because I'm still aiming for like a four hour stream. I'm really enjoying this game. It's been fun to stream, too, because it, it has some good conversations. Good conver conversation starters. Yep, bye. How are the babies doing today? They were all still alive. Not a single one of our children died. We have all eight. Um, they really hadn't changed a whole lot, though. They didn't learn any new words. They're still talking about Pabra. And, uh, Pratt. Did you hear about Pat- Patabox coming to the Switch? What the fuck is Patabox? Never heard of that. Pots and bolts. Ha ha ha. Oh, the duck boxing game! Right, 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 right! You mean Little Quack! Right. Yeah, that was cool. I'll definitely check that out again. I don't know how you guys expect me to remember the name of every fucking game I've played in every grab bag ever. But that's cool. I haven't really seen anything about that since I played it. I remember I didn't really have whole, a whole lot of problems with that other than some of the, the timing felt weird on some of the telegraphs. I felt like they could have cleaned that up a bit, but... That's cool. The game should have been called Little Quack. Well, I feel like it would have kind of... You know, I don't think that making your game's name 
a reference to another series is all that good I an idea. What is that pose, Goofy? Okay. These dudes are annoying. Nope. Alright. Got him. These guys give you a shitload of experience. Why do you never use Sonic Blade? Because it takes up a shitload of my fucking magic. And I don't want to, like, waste it for the boss fight. Okay. I should probably cure. Yeah, it uses a shitload of mana, at least on the first attack. Can you just stop being a stone? It's a stone! Turn back to normal, boy. Alright, good. For Daisy, I guess. Bot? Nope, not boss yet. Alright, from now on, I'm not using any more magic till the boss, unless I need to heal. Boss? Nope. Wow, this is fucking longer than I remember it being. I probably will unlock another fucking, uh, cup after this, too. Because I did this one late. Oh, boy. Oh, come on. Oh, it tells you how- okay, alright. I didn't see that. I guess it tells you how many- There we go. First seed! Alright, there we go. Okay, summon- don't have enough for a summon. I might save up for the Bambi summon. And then I'll use Sonic, I think. It sounded like she he just said Yuffie. <laughs> no, 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 it's not! I just fucking reflected her shurikens. Oh! What the fuck is that, sword? Okay, alright, alright, alright. Yo, 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 don't kill me! Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me! You don't stand a chance against me. Jesus Christ, he has a lot of fucking health. Oh, boy. Maybe I shouldn't save up for Bambi, and maybe I should just use Sonic when I can. Yeah, I don't have Tinkerbell yet. Sonic! Sonic! Sonic is very, very fucking good. Alright, just gonna finish off Yuffie now. Nice. Good shit. What is Tinker Tinkerbell does auto life? Good shit. We're the champs. We're the champs. That was great. Looks like Phil's trained another great hero. Is strength the most important part of a hero? Well, what you really need is a strong heart. Ugh. What makes a strong heart? If you have to ask, you're not a hero yet. Stop talking in riddles. It's not a riddle! I bet I could do another challenge, too. 
We'll see. I wouldn't mind doing one more. Uh, nope. There isn't another one. I might be done then. Yeah, I didn't get any more SP. No one got any more SP, I don't think. Oh, except for you. I'm gonna save up, though. Shared. Did you know the PS4 takes a picture every time you get a trophy? I didn't. Why? So you can, like, see the moment you got the trophy? Alright, I think we're- I think we're good then. Yeah, we'll- we'll switch to Yoshi. Okay. Alright, that was a pretty successful stream. We finished one world, so that's good. Um... Yeah, that was Kingdom Hearts for the night. I'm gonna switch to Yoshi's Island in a moment. If you feel like sticking around, feel free. If not, thank you for sticking around. I will talk to you in a couple minutes. I'm just gonna do a quick BRB.